out here today at uh, Lake Birian with my uh, good friend Tom Tom. And he, we are out here now doing, you know, feeder fishing like always. It's cold, uh, as you can see, it's end of December. And we caught a fish, so I want to show you that fish. Um, here it is, in the water. We're gonna change to bigger fish lures because we're catching a lot of these smaller fish right now, silver fish. We even caught two really small, uh, one mirror carp and one um, scaled one, a common carp. So we're gonna see if we should change tactics, but at least we're catching fish, you know, even though it's December, it's really cold and it's a really small lake. I'll show you the lake with the camera up. So this is how it looks. It's a couple of hectare, perhaps one or something. And I'll just, we'll just release that small fish. Here it comes, Tom Tom and the fish. You see? <laughs> see a nice one, looks like a small, I don't know, it might be a... <laughs> okay, it's going back. He's putting it back in the water and there he went. So yeah, hopefully guys, I will come back, you know, with some bigger fish. <laughs> yeah, guys, the small fish are coming in a row. Uh, they, they like the maggot on the dark feeder. No, they ran away, but they're really attacking a lot. Uh, I'm going to film now, show you when, you know, when they hit it, so you'll see the rod tip. So guys, this is how the rod tip looks. I got one of those red corn, you know, I dyed uh, myself, uh, remember, from that last video. And also this uh, drenched in vanilla taste. So it's like full of small fish here, uh, out where that water, you know, is running away from the three out, tree out here. So we're gonna perhaps try to put on a bigger lure, see if there's bigger fish among all those small ones. Uh, yeah, so I'll come back if anything happens. Now I have a red wafter on the heavy setup, as you can see here, and uh, I threw it out there. Right now nothing is touching it uh, at the moment, but we'll see what happens. So guys, uh, we change now to fake corn on the light setup and to a uh, red pellet because these small fish are really like, you know, they won't stop <laughs> biting. I mean, it's good, but they're really small. So here I threw this one out by the tree in front of us, just right by the tree. And there's a lot of action on it, uh, but no fish is getting stuck. This is the red pellet one. As you can see, you know, it's really like the rod tip is dancing. They're eating the feed. I'm assuming the small fish but they can't take the pellet because it's too big. And what I'm hoping for is that a bigger carp comes along, you know, and it disturbs, you know, scares them away, the smaller ones from the feed, and then takes that red pellet. You see, it's really dancing and jumping. There might even be a small fish, you know, stuck on the hook, I don't know. But yes, yeah, we're trying to get the bigger ones to, to show for you guys. So guys, we changed spot now. Over there, we're getting too many small fish. They weren't leaving, you know, our feed alone. So we came down here and Tom Tom's got a, what is that, Tom Tom? A really small <laughs> fish that's foul hooked. <laughs> what the hell, dude? It got stuck in the butt for some reason. It looks like, you know, we were rigging with live bait, but we haven't. <laughs> Guys, so it's getting dark and we got a big one now on a 20 millimeter boily in a squid color. It's gonna be a big carp. Ay, 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 he's putting a nice bend in the rod. You see, he's coming now. Oh, I can see this! Punch, punch! <laughs> it's a good crew! And he came on boy leave! Oh, Tom Tom! Hold on! Again, Tom Tom, you're trying to net it. It's a better, it's not so huge, but it's still good. <laughs> Tom Tom! Tom Tom caught it! Oh, wait, Tom Tom caught it! <laughs> oh my god, guys! We got some chaos when we're netting the fish! But we got him out! Oh my god, such a nice! Carp. Hold on, hold on, I'm gonna get the hook out. Oh. Okay, the hook is out now. Here you can see the big, he's crashed. I had a little pop-up on, uh, on top of the boily. It was a 20 millimeter, nice, as you can see here, 20 millimeter squid boily. I'm gonna hold up the carp. He's a nice, around the kilogram, pretty carp, mirror common carp. I'm so happy, guys. Tom Tom takes a picture and as always I'm covering his eyes now remember guys good tip if they get because I can feel him struggling he's getting uh, tense he came just as the sun is going down okay I'm okay. gonna put him back now in the net Opa. beautiful fish back okay Tom Tom and here's the fish one last time okay, we'll, let's let him relax a bit in the nets remember guys let him relax, catch his strength. Just open the net. <laughs> <Yes>! <laughs> that last one, that's what I'm talking about, bro. 
fanatic fishing. I mean, he came out there by the tree. I told Tom Tom, the tree looks so sexy, it looks so good. And then finally, man, it came because we've been catching those really small fish. And finally, it came. Now I'm gonna throw out again with the boilie and hope for another one. fanatics so yeah as you can see now i'm not by the lake anymore it got really dark so i couldn't do the outro so i'm doing the outro now at home instead so i hope you enjoyed this video i mean you saw that we got all those small fish and uh, you know then we changed uh, to that boily because i was thinking like that tree looks so good it's gotta be something more than you know those really small carp we were catching catching and yeah as you saw it came like one to one and a half kilogram real nice common carp beautiful scales you know and I released him or her, went back as you could see. So, I mean, it's good to, you know, I had that, you know, like stomach feeling like it's gotta be got something more here, guys. You know, it's gotta be more. So I'm gonna give that lake another shot, you know, definitely, because I think there's more potential there than what we, you know, explore today. I mean, so like anyways, like always, like, subscribe, you know, any questions, comments, drop them below, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any, you know, uh, new videos that come along. And uh, yeah, until then, you know, fish a lot, take care, and see you soon on another Fanatic Fishing video. Mm -hmm.